Hey guys, it's Melody Lane. I want you to make something you love really big and put it above your door or on your wall or anywhere you want it like I did. So I'm gonna show you how to do that in this video. You are watching Melody Lane. With me you're gonna have a great crafting time. So here's the images I used. It's free in Cricut Access. It's Make Something You Love. It's their logo for their events they have going on. To find this image, you click on images on your canvas and then you type in the hashtag or the number sign M33EA. 37B. So you type that in in the search where the images are and it'll come up. This is how I did it. It starts out as one piece. I made it as big as I wanted it. I measured about how big I wanted it and what would fit and then I cut it into sections. Like here's one section and another section and another one. And I show you how to do this in another video of how to cut it up and I will put a link to that in the cards in the upper right hand corner of the video you'll see how I cut up the projects this is only 25% the little squares on the grid are an inch big so if I were to make this 100% it's pretty big And then when I go to make it, it tells me it's going to be on a 12 by 24 mat, which is what I wanted. So I didn't have to break it up so much. And so that's how it cut it. So let me show you how to put it on the wall. So I'm doing this in picture form. I did not record putting it all together and putting it up on the wall. So I laid out one piece of Cricut transfer tape as wide as my project, sticky side up. I printed off a picture of my project and I printed it off mirrored because I'm putting it all on upside down. So I need to look at the mirrored project to put it on correctly. I wanted to start at the bottom. So I put my heart down first. Now the heart is layered and it was very difficult to try to get the white piece right on top of the pink piece so I cut the white piece and did it in sections here I added two more sheets of the Cricut transfer tape I layered them just a little bit underneath each other so the top layer would be the top layer to pull off first now it's time to piece everything together I started right there at the top of the line where they were cut off placed that middle section on lining it up right there just above the love next I lined up the next one and tried to connect each letter as close as I possibly could now I'm reapplying the back of the train to cover tape. the project that I've already done once that's covered I put in the last piece so I can finish my project okay after I put them all down lining them up very carefully it was difficult I cover the entire thing with the backing from the transfer tape make sure you clean or dust your wall first and then we bring it up the ladder this is Kelly my assistant I highly recommend you do not do this alone and have someone to help you when we put the paper back on we left about one inch of stickiness available at the very top so we could kind of line this up and stick that transfer tape to the wall and once we know it's straight she can read in underneath and pull down part of the backing from the transfer tape while pressing down on the letters with a scraper tool a large scraper tool and now she's peeling off the transfer tape really slowly making sure it's sticking to the wall okay here it is finished I love this this makes me so happy here are a few different angles of it in my house and I love it when people walk into my house it's the first thing they see. It makes me happy and I hope you can make it to make you happy too. If you're not subscribed already and you wanna see more, make sure you're subscribed and click that little bell. And thanks for watching. And here's a shout out to a few of the people who support this channel on Patreon. Mary, Sherry, Venetia, Brenda, Ashley, Gail, Savannah, Mary, Julie, Linda, Crystal, Jean, Tony, Debbie, Pamela, Sandy, Tasha, Mare, Paula, Melanie, Carolyn, Beverly, Tina, Reggie, Crafting with JD, Crystal, 
Kristen, Bontas, Carol, Shannon, Carol, Veronica, Linda, Donna, Connie, Paula, Brianna, Terry, Joyce, Shelly, Barbara, Asha, Dawn, Dorothy, Tracy, Kathy, Jackie, Linda, Jan, Tabitha, Darlene, Donna, Shannon, Ginger, Susan, Emily, Misty, Susan, Kathy, Victoria, Pam, Carrie, Sue, Erica, Janie, Lori, Bridget, Debbie, Sue, Florence, Robin, Mary Ann, Penny, Connie, Catherine, Nancy, Sherry, Connie, Valerie, Mandy, Purple Paisley, Marnie, Nettie, Connie, and Sharon.